how about we do it? So here's, I'm just gonna like, this is the problem, I pretty much quit. I, I fell off the face of the earth. I like how long my legs look. Welcome back to another Stephen Casey video. Um, it has been a long time, I'm a little bit rusty, I don't remember how to YouTube, and I keep making videos saying I'm gonna come back, and I never do. So this is just gonna be a video explaining what's happened in the past three months, because I haven't touched my channel in that long, what I've been doing, what I've focused on, and the comeback of my channel, because I just now have had the passion to start filming again, because at this point, I. The only reason I do YouTube and everything, there's Good Good, which is my main focus and everything. I just do my personal channel for fun. If I like, if I enjoy going out and playing golf or filming the horse track, I just do it for fun. Which we'll get into that. We'll get into that whole situation. But just wanted to make a video, just explaining everything because I, I I pretty much quit. I I fell off the face of the earth for uh, like three months on my own channel. It's been more like two years. No, probably a year and a half. I haven't. Max is here watch and make sure and I say the right things. Um, it's, probably, it's probably been a good year since I have been consistent, a year and a half since I've literally just gone out every day and filmed. That has a lot to do with good, good becoming as big as it is. I mean, it, 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 we are seeing things inside the company that I've met, like it, it has hit a different level and it's just better to put my focus on that right now than just messing around on my uh, own channel just for fun. So that's where my main focus is, is Good Good. We used to just do one week, but now as we've grown, it, Good Good takes up pretty much the whole month. There, at random times, I could get a call in the middle of the month and say, you gotta fly out here and come back. So I just have released my channel, not released, I let my channel go pretty much, and I've just been, whatever Good Good wants, Good Good gets from Steve. So that's kind of where my focus has been. We got into stores, uh, we changed offices, we, we're leaving <clears throat> the Good Good, office which was in like Frisco Square and now we're going to um, a warehouse up the street so we're, we're doing that. For my own personal channel the like for the past year I have had no passion and when you don't have passion you're just filming videos to film videos and it you people can tell you're not enjoying what you're doing so that's why I just focus on good good I like it I like that but I finally have the position where I can lock in on my own channel and I'm not saying I'm gonna come back posting five videos a week I'm just going to post probably at least two times a week um, for the next, man, I don't want to get a date because then people will keep me to it. How about five months? <clears throat> How about we do, so here's, I'm just going to like, this is the problem, like filming right now, we just got back from the UK, we were there for 11 days, I just take a, took a break for like a week, just stayed in my room and didn't see see anybody, and then we have a tour the 12, for 12 days. And then, and then we get a month off. So maybe I can make this happen. I can make this happen. I, I have also filmed videos. Like I didn't just quit. I do. I was at in Missouri, which this is another reason I'm making this video because I had a bunch of videos filmed. And it would make no sense that you just see a random videos from random times coming on my channel. I just that wouldn't make sense. But well, I can look at this camera too. What the heck? Yeah. I have filmed three golf videos in the past. Uh, like five months and they just never got edited not never got anything which if you see just random golf videos coming on my channel just know I filmed those months ago but for the most recent in two months ago I went down to Missouri and had which again people ask me about the horse track the horse track has been getting worked on I just stopped filming it I wasn't enjoying filming it and I felt like if everything I did for a while was on camera like every if I, if I went out and played golf and I wasn't filming I just felt like I was wasting my time it like it, it got so bad, so that's why I kind of just took a step away so I could get back into it just enjoying YouTube as a whole. Because once you get burnt out, and I, I know I've seen a lot of people go through it, it, it just, you can just tell in your content. So that's like the main reason I took a step back. Also, Good Good has just hit different levels and, and that's, that's where I like spending most of my time. But I filmed um, two videos because I just, I had a pond being built because I needed water somewhere to get water to irrigate the grass. So I, I didn't film any of, I didn't film me like hiring everybody and like I usually do, but I went down at the end cause I was in, uh, I was in Missouri and I filmed a little bit. So there's two videos, one a kind of like a, me just going to the horse track, a little update, showing you guys around. And then the second video is going to be <clears throat> the ponds. I, I built a pond um, and I basically, and basically for that it's just for watering, but it also I love fishing. So I bought a bunch of structure and you guys can watch the video. I don't want to just 
tell you if everything happened, you can just watch it. But I did, I did that. <clears throat> yeah, so there's a couple videos of there, but I'm trying to get fully back into YouTube and you just got it. For me, I just got to jump back in and just, yeah, and I, for, for like schedule, I'm trying to get back on a schedule, which I will release another video saying exactly when, because right now I'm just trying to figure out how all this is going to work of getting editors and videographers and just all the things behind the scenes that I need. But I'm going to try to post two times a week for sure. Just two videos that can either be like a golf match, a fun video, or it's going to be me trying to get better. Cause that's a one thing recently I, I had the goal of, of breaking 80, which I'm not going to give it away, but that was going to be a whole series. And sometime in the UK, Steven ended up breaking 80, which was the first time ever. Yeah. Uh, anyways, there, that was going to be one of the series was breaking 80 and I ended up, I ended up doing that in the UK. So that's crazy. I might be able to clip that round together in like six months and throw it up. Just me hitting balls, but we'll see what happens. <clears throat> that I just want to get better at golf. And once again, I, the for, it was the first time like in June, first time I've ever just gone out, played 18 holes without filming it. And I did that at PJ West and it, like i can't describe the feeling it is, it is amazing because there's no it usually in youtube like once you get into something like youtube your mind only thinks when you're on a golf course that if you make a hole in one you know other people want to see it you just like in my mind this goes to every every possible way like the, a cool shot or something i'm just like dang i should have been filming that but yeah I'm, I'm just gonna try to get back on a schedule i think the last time i posted a video where i just was sitting there talking it was called the truth that i posted and yeah i just from that point on i kind of knew I knew I wasn't gonna be involved with my channel for a while because I just needed to take a break. But we're back. I filmed some content here and there, and I'm gonna get back on a schedule. My goal is to become a scratch golfer by the end of this year. Psych. My goal is actually to be consistently breaking 80 by the end of this year. And whatever that is, I, you guys have seen on the Good Good Extras. I, I've got some uh, practicing with Cam McCormick. I did some practice with him. And a lot of the times you can get a lesson if you don't practice that, then it's not going to happen. And a lot of the, a lot of the times, I mean, my body isn't built like it, like it, before the accident, I had no problems. I was, I could walk around, do whatever I needed. But since my back got destroyed in the accident, I have been have to, I've had to switch like how I swing. So I don't put as much pressure And that lesson is what helped me a lot before I went to the UK. Cause it taught me how, I don't know, I, I just felt like I was compressing my back so much and it just continuous injuries. And after that, I've been able to, like, I can get on, I can go play golf once a week and, and be perfectly fine. I won't have any, like my back isn't to the point where I'm just gonna stop, but hopefully that continues because at any point my back could just give out and you see Steve never play golf again. So that, that's also always a possibility, but I'm just gonna try to nur nurse it back into just prime Steve, which I never did have a prime, but we're going to find it and we're going to make it happen. It's kind of a rundown. We have two farm videos coming, some golf videos, but I would like to start taking trips with, uh, with, for my channel and just filming, I don't know, like three days, just golf, get some content, come back, chill, do the good, good stuff. But, uh, that's just kind of the goal. And I, I, like I said, I've been, I just got kind of burnt out for a while and I had to take a step back. That's where I've been. I've been chilling hitting the gym sometimes. I don't, I don't honestly, my day-to-day -day life is, is very strange. Maybe I do a day in the life. You definitely should, 100%. I, I might do a day in the life at some point. But anyways, this is just an update. I probably rambled a lot. I quit YouTube for a while, but I'm back.